How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here and today I am going to show you a brand new mod that I found, well new to me, and it basically adds Dragon Ball Z's Vegeta to Brawlhalla. That's right, we have Vegeta the Prince of Saiyans in Brawlhalla and it looks really good if I say so myself. Not only does this mod come in three versions, we have Base Vegeta, Super Saiyan Vegeta, and Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, but it also comes with some custom signature graphics, which I will show you in a minute. Now, unfortunately, the mod is split into three different versions. Like I said, we have the base, the Super Saiyan, and the Super Saiyan Blue. I can't just switch between them easily. I actually have to install a different file of the mod depending on which one I want. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and start with base Vegeta. And I got... He looks kind of weird with those knives, huh? Let's give him something else. Uh, but yeah, if you want this mod, I will leave a link to it in the description of the video. If you don't know how to install mods, I will also leave a link to a video that I made on how to install mods. Uh, but the mod is free, but you do need Diamond Head Caspian in order to use the mod. That's it. Diamond Head Caspian, you're on PC. Boom, the mod is free. So I'm going to play, like I said, one game with each. Let's start it out with base vegeta prince of saiyans and i'm not gonna lie guys dragon ball z is it's it's very close to me it was one of my favorite i'll just say it was pretty much my favorite show when i was a young adult teenager type person <laughs> i loved it watched every episode many times and it nothing would make me happier really than an official dragon ball z crossover like with Vegeta, Goku, and maybe Gohan or Trunks. Trunks is actually my favorite uh, person from Dragon Ball Z, but but these this mod looks super good. I don't really know if Caspian is the best choice, but whatever. I didn't make the mod. El Monkey did, so I'm just happy it's here. I'm not gonna complain, you know. Oh yeah, I did mention the custom signature graphics, and you guys are probably wondering where they are. They're actually only on uh, gauntlets so let me go ahead and just switch weapons if I can find one so battle pack week, week three missions are here I hope you guys are doing well on those so you can kind of hard to see but it's a little bit different looking and then look at the neutral sig he actually shoots a little energy blast which is so cool I'm trying to hit him with the side sig so you guys can see what that looks like. Boom. He also puts a little energy blast. Oops. I don't know why my chase dodge didn't come out, but it didn't. Oh my goodness, what a ground pound. <laughs> Yo, I will, I will do that. I will wish upon a star. Bro, this Mordex is coming back. I got, I, whoa, what, what is happening? The comeback is real. I haven't even touched him in a long time. There we go. Oh, that's game. That's game. GG, dude, GG. Hey, it looks like Vegeta's flying right there. All right, that was uh, game one. Now I have to actually exit the game so I can install the mod file for Super Saiyan Vegeta, and I will be right back. And I'm back. I just installed the Super Saiyan version of the mod. Let's see if it worked. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Vegeta Super Saiyan. Oh, I actually forgot to use the uh, next level emote. So we'll use that in the next video. Also, guys, if you do install the mod and you get a bunch of error messages when you boot up or holla, don't worry about it. It's perfectly normal and the mod should still work. I, I did notice, though, when I have this mod installed, especially with the custom signature graphics, it does kind of mess up some graphics of some other signatures. Like I noticed uh, Val, her gauntlet neutral signature, didn't have the graphics on it anymore. But it's all good. If you ever want to get rid of the mod, you can just reinstall Burhala and it would be perfectly fine. I did mention Battle Pass Week 3 missions. And as you can see, I've already completed all of them. They're actually not that hard to do. So if you need any advice on how to do any of these, just let me know by commenting down below. And I will gladly give you some advice on that. But... Now let's go ahead and play some Super Saiyan Vegeta. 
I just love the gold forged colors on this uh, skin because it matches the golden hair. So, man, I, I don't know. I just can't get over Vegeta with the guitars. It just looks so weird. What do you guys think would have been a better uh, legend to do this skin on? I don't even know. The gauntlets look great. I mean, obviously Vegeta fights only with his fists in the in the show. He don't fight with any weapons like katars or sword or anything like that. So it's going to be hard, but I think uh, maybe a different gauntlet legend. Maybe even core. I don't know. It would be weird seeing Vegeta with a hammer, I got to say. But would it be less weird than seeing him with katars? I don't even know. Bro. Oh my gosh. He's getting he's getting on fire. Nice try. Oh my goodness. That is the power of a Super Saiyan right there, boys. I love the little orb too. The little energy blast looks so cute. Bro, where are you going? What? He disconnected? We were having such a good fight, too. Like, it was very close. I don't know why he disconnected. Feels bad. I'm going to go ahead and finish this bot. Oh, he reconnected. I'm going to kill myself then so that it's fair. All right. He must have been lagging. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and make it final stocks just so that it's a little bit closer of a game. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, now I'm lagging. No, no. The lag transferred from him to me. <laughs> GG, dude, GG. Well played, well played. Well, there's the Super Saiyan Vegeta with the next level taunt. I forgot to do it. Uh, wow, I am getting so much lag. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and install the Super Saiyan Blue version of this mod, and I will be right back. We will hopefully get another win. All right, I am back. I just installed Super Saiyan Blue version of Vegeta. And guys, I forgot to even tell you, but oh, let's go Skyforge. Oh, my goodness. Look at how good that looks. I forgot to tell you, but there's also a part of this mod that you can install optionally that will change the next level emote to also be blue. Look how amazing that looks. I'll show you in the game. Look at this. Ah, so much power. How amazing is that? I wonder if the uh, graphics, no, they're still yellow. <laughs> All right, guys. Ooh, I'm going against Bacon. We're probably going to get destroyed if this is the Bacon that is a pro player or was a pro player. I don't remember. Now, that had a Bacon, like, underscore, right? So this is a different Bacon. Oh, look, my, my spaceship is gone. What is happening? Okay. Well, sometimes when you install mods, they get a little bit crazy. So it's to be expected. Oh, my gosh. I'm getting lag now. Maybe it won't matter. Oh boy, oh boy, this is bad. Boom! Get out of here, Thor! You might be the god of thunder. But I am a Super Saiyan God. Oof. Let's go. We are just shredding at this point. That move is so good because it's hard to punish. Ooh, baby. I haven't played Caspian in a while, but he's actually really fun. I think the leg uh, actually stopped too, which is great. Because I would probably would have gotten destroyed had the leg continued. Ooh. 
Ooh, no. Well, no three stock for a Prince of Saiyans. You know, I, in the show, they always call him the Prince of Saiyans, but his dad actually died, like, at the beginning, you know, well, no spoilers, but yeah, at the beginning, like, when the planet was destroyed, I'm pretty sure, so, like, wouldn't he, Vegeta just basically become king automatically then? We'll, we'll call him the King of Saiyans at this point. He is Super Saiyan God. I just want to hit the neutral sig or the down sig. Sheesh. He making it very hard for us. He didn't fall for that one. Boom! Right on the back. That should be game. Never mind. I'm just going to help him back up on the stage, guys. What am I doing? He he just will not go into that neutral sig. Normally, I can get, like, at least one hit per game on it. Oh, no. That side sig hurt. All right, Bacon. Time to fulfill your destiny and become my breakfast. Ooh. <laughs> well, that was an explosive ending. GG, dude, GG. Got a little bit of gems there. That's always good. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I just wanted to show off this cool mod. And if you enjoy it, go ahead and drop a like and be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content because I am always putting it out there. And guys, I am super duper close to getting the new scythe, which I can't wait to look at in all the other colors and skins that we have. So look forward to that video. I definitely will make a video once I unlock the scythe. And uh, unfortunately, <laughs> because I completed all the missions, it's gonna probably take a while for me to unlock it. New missions in five days. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. This is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.